Hey everybody, welcome to the video. Hope you're having a good day. We've got a box of half dollars here that we are going to go through. I already opened them up. I didn't see any specific enders in this box. I checked both sides, uh, but uh, hopefully we're gonna find some silver, maybe some toned coins, foreigns. All right, let's get into this and we'll get back to you with our first find. We are 19 rolls into the box and we have our first find and it is a toned coin. Looks like somebody marked it up with a Sharpie there, but that should uh, come off. Nice uh, greens and yellows, kind of swirl toning there. Not as evident on the reverse, but the front of that looks awesome. Love the toned coin, so that one will definitely be going into our album. We'll stick that in our album at the end of uh, this search. All right, cool. Well, we've got more than half a box left to go. Hopefully we can find some more stuff. Just a couple of rolls later and we have our next find. Didn't uh, recognize this one by the edge. Usually NIFCs uh, stand out, but this one's got some toning on it. It's a 2011 Denver. That is fine two out of the box in our first NIFC. We'll add that to our toned coin there. Let's get back into the hunt. We are now 32 rolls into the box and our next find another NIFC. This time it's a 2007 Philadelphia. All right, so that makes two out of this box. And we've still got 18 rolls to go. Let's see if we can pull a silver out of here. That would be awesome. A few rolls later and we have a couple more finds. We found two NIFCs in this last roll. 2012 Denver. Looks like it was on the end of a roll at one time. It's got that little crimping ring of death. Whoops, whatever. And in the same roll, a 2008 Philadelphia. So we're up to four NIFCs. And in a previous roll, we did find this hold coin here in 1972 Philadelphia. I know some people collect those. Alrighty, 12 more rolls to go. Just a few rolls later and we got our next find. This is an interesting coin. I have not seen one toned like this before. It's almost got a swirling kind of pattern to it there. Doesn't have a lot of color, uh, dark uh, browns and kind of bronze color there, but the 1972 Denver, it's on both sides. The obverse is a little more pronounced there, but that's pretty cool. We'll hold on to that one for sure. All right, nine more rolls. Second to last roll and we got our next find here. Another NIFC, it's a 2006 Philadelphia. All right, so we're up to five. Yep, I can count five NIFCs. We got one roll left. Let's see if we can pull something special out of that roll. All right, so here were the finds after searching through that box of half dollars. We didn't find any silver, but we did find a few other things here. We have five NIFCs, a 2006 Philadelphia, 2007 Philadelphia. 2008 Philadelphia, a 2011 Denver, and a 2012 Denver. And we found this 1972 hold coin. I think people probably make uh, necklaces or pendants or something out of those. And then we found two tone coins here. That one's pretty, a 1973 Philadelphia. I think that's showing up pretty good. Beautiful, and this one has some interesting toning, swirling going on with that. Not sure what would cause that, but that is pretty cool. So we are going to add these to our half dollar album that I have for just my toned coins. And we'll open it to the second page here. Got some really neat ones in here. We're gonna add these. Alrighty, awesome album. Man, that's I love this one right here. Check that out. Awesome. Dansko albums right here. In love with these things, absolutely in love with them. 
Anyway, that one is number 7157. It's just a uh, blank port half dollar album. So anyway, those were our finds. Hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you guys in the next one.